today is Sunday. I already got ready. It's now what, 9 p.m. I'm in the garden to make the little intro and the plan for today is to go to Cyprus which is a city that's very west and there we're gonna see a fortress and I think a lighthouse as well and it's also the most west part of Europe I'm not really sure I have to check that there's not much to see there but I feel like when you're in the south that's a must see so that's what we're gonna do and depending on how long it takes we're gonna improvise for the afternoon and maybe go to the beach or we don't know yet the drive from here Luli to Cyprus is over one hour so hopefully it will be all right right now we're trying to find a breakfast place it's not even that early but everything is still closed and there's like no one in the streets <laughs> so we just stopped at this little cafe and I got a meat bread with something similar to meta I also got a pineapple Just arrived in Cyprus and we parked here. There's quite a lot of parking, so if you come here, you don't have to worry about that. It's really pretty. And now we're going to see the views and also the fortress that you can probably see here, I think. Can you see it? I don't know. But yeah. To enter in the fort, you have to pay three euros for adults, and if you are a student, you can pay one fifty. The shadow rocket to the moon, but it ran out of view. A chance was lost for a hero to be made. They shook their heads and said, What a shame! This was no death, but a rebirth. I release you. To earth, so you fell to the sea, just off the coast of Aberdeen. You know me, and I can't hold a weight like this. Something's got to give. So we we'll also go there, which is Cabo de São Vicente. We just arrived at Sao Cabo de São Vicente, which is the most west point of Europe or Portugal or both. And we just got a little snack first because we're really hungry. Drinks as well. These are German, I think. Sausages and just gonna eat a little bit before going to the point. Got 
So now we visited Cabo de Cabo São Vicente, Vicente? Cabo São Vicente. <laughs> and since there's not much more to do in Sagres, we are going to go to the Sun City this afternoon, which wasn't planned, but it looks really cool, so we're gonna do that. And on the way there, we're going to find a restaurant. So hopefully, we find a good restaurant. So we just arrived in San City. I slept all the way here. And so this place is a place where they have a lot of sand sculpture. And yeah, we paid 11 euros. And I'm really excited to see the sculptures here. If you have trypophobia like me, some sculptures might trigger you here. So just be careful of that. So we just finished the Sun City visit and honestly it's like nice to see but it's definitely not worth 11 euros in my opinion it's just like statues there and that's it like there's no activities you don't even see the process of the people making it and now we're going to go to another city to find a restaurant to eat our lunch at 5 p.m we just stopped at this random restaurant that's called al Xama, and it's like a steakhouse apparently they produce their own like cows and stuff like that and their owner is from Madeira so the style of the meat is will be like Madeira style she craves my happiness and devalues hers she does not know what love is spits at her own before the sun sets so we're gonna head to the pool it's night time now so we're just going to play the pool can't you see can't you see how very simple it can be I'm just quickly gonna end my vlog here because we're just gonna play some pool and then probably shower and go to sleep and not much else to do. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and tomorrow is gonna be a very exciting one. We're going to be horse riding and kayaking so stay tuned for that one and thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys! The feeling